so this is how I'm supposed to have my hand at the end? Yes, With this the, is oh, a circle mark. The circle mark. All right, folks, come on, join us, because I really should not be doing this by myself. <laughs> I want you to join us. Okay, join us, everybody. And have some fun while you exercise your body on a taste of L.A. I mean, Belize, Belize L.A. Belize. A taste of Belize, L.A. <laughs> And the Althea oh. Moses move, right? Yes, now the exercise. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Are you ready out there? All right, here we go. We're going to do this without the leg movements first. So we're going to warm up our body. And you can use this as a warm-up for about five minutes, non-stop. And then you repeat. You say affirmation. So Sandra and everybody, repeat after me. I'm healthy. I'm healthy. I'm healthy. I'm healthy. I'm, healthy. I'm getting fit. 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 I'm determined to be 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 fit. Okay, now we're going to do some leg movements. And this is jogging in place. Instead of your normal jogging in place, you're doing holding the, the circle mark and repeating affirmations. I'm healthy. I'm healthy. I'm healthy. I'm healthy. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm healthy. I'm healthy. I'm getting fit. I'm getting fit. I'm getting fit. I'm getting fit. Okay, change your leg position like this. I'm getting fit. I'm getting fit. Now turn my foot. I'm getting fit. I'm getting fit. All right, Elsie, I'm getting tired. I'm getting fit. Okay. So that's a sample of the Althea exercise. Oh, So wow. that's one of my secrets to stay in tone and healthy. Oh, okay. So how often do you do this? About two to three days per week. Okay. Because I also do, I teach my class on Tuesdays. I have a fitness studio where oh, I teach okay. Althea from 7 to 8, and so... That's the fourth day. But on my own, three days per week. And um, that's really, really what you need if you want to maintain your health. Mm -hmm. Three days of cardio and at least two days of strength training. Okay. And strength training is what I was telling you about earlier. It could be push-ups. Mm -hmm. It could be squats. It could be lunges. It could be pull-ups. And so you must do that if you want to burn more calories okay. after you're done with your cardio workout. Okay. So the Althea is considered a cardio workout. Oh, all right. It's not strength training. I mean, I really could feel my heart yes. rate going up. Yes. I do walk, but my walk is, I have a very steep hill that I walk. Mm -hmm. And that hill is no joke. Yes. So I know I'm getting the cardio when I walk up that hill. What else do I need to do after that? Very good. Well. Uh, you can also do um, push-ups. Push-ups are very okay. good for working your upper body. Your arms, if you want to get your bicep, your, your shoulders, your tricep, your chest muscles stronger, okay. and you want them to tone, then you would do push-ups. Just to start. All right. You, there are other things to do with, weight, with weights, but you can do push-ups anywhere. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay. So I can show you some push-ups. I am personally not a fan of push-ups. I don't know if I... I don't know how to do push-ups. I've never learned how to do oh, push-ups. Oh, wow. I would love to teach you today on your show. Would you like that? On camera? <laughs> yes. Would you like to see Sandra do some push-ups for better health? Woo. Before she eats that right, let, me, let me see. <laughs> let me see. Uh, cameraman, if I'm not doing it right, cut. <laughs> okay. All you got right. a deal. All okay. Right. So push-ups are pretty simple. They have, for beginners, you can do the push-ups on your knees, like this, okay? And I'm going to turn sideways so they can see the angle first, okay? So you can do, for beginners, if you've never done a push-up or you don't feel confident doing a so push-up. I can do a push-up, right? Uh, I can do a push-up. <laughs> Amazing! She got off the already. That's what I'm talking about. Now push up. You put your hands in front of you like this, and um, have your arms, um, your uh, shoulder length at least. You can do it wide stance, but um, that's for advanced people. Okay, if you want to V back. But you simply have it about shoulder length, and for uh, they call this the girly push up. So the knees are on the ground. You just bend your elbows and push up. Bend the elbows and push up. 
I went down pretty far because I'm at advanced fitness level, right? But if you're a beginner, this is a push-up. That's where you are, that's where you start. And that's okay. So Sandra, well, you were doing a good job. Really? Yes. You know, I want to have nice arms and I need to, I really need to do something. And you just started. And like I said, I have friends that, you know, they need to do the same thing. Family members, we all need to be in good health. Yes, and, and, and uh, push-ups is a great way, a great exercise to improve your, okay. your physical health, as well as your mental health if you're re repeating those affirmations. So okay. when you're doing your push-up, I'm getting fit. I'm getting fit. I'm determined to be fit. Okay. So Althea can be incorporated in your exercise and your daily life. Okay. You can and be healthier. What I like about the Althea move, um, movements and the affirmation is, like I was saying, you know, you're out and about and there's so much negative going on. Mm. People say negative. So if you're saying affirmations to yourself, I mean, what better way to improve your life, you yes, know? Yes, indeed. So guys, try the Althea Moses workout. I mean, next time you see me, maybe you won't recognize me <laughs> because I'm getting fit. <laughs> Sandra's getting fit. Sandra's getting fit. All right, we'll be right back.